folks, it's me, Brian, and this is what I'm drinking this afternoon. I'm drinking Hog Hop IPA from the Lancaster Brewing Company in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. It is 6% alcohol by volume, and it actually gives the IBUs, 60 IBUs, and the original gravity, 14.5. It says pour in a pint glass, and the color is deep gold. It also has a description, Hawk, Hop Hog IPA. It's a India style pale ale. You're in for a hard charging yet remarkable drinkable brew in our Hop Hog IPA. Delivering a solid malt profile and layered, uh, layered hop flavors from Magnum, Citra, and Cascade. Now I've heard of Citra before, that screams IPA. We double down on the dry hopping for even more fresh hop character and refreshing flavor. So folks, I will be the judge of that. I have a pint glass. Let's crack this one open. Oh, Semi-aggressive pour, needs a lot of head. It is a gold color, maybe more yellowish. They call it deep gold. I wouldn't call this deep gold. I know you're probably not getting the best lighting, but um, it's not really a deep gold. It may look that way, but it's not really a deep gold. Kind of like a pale gold, if you will. Smell? Uh, citra hops, you can smell it. You can smell the IPA here. You can smell the, that hoppiness, that grassy hoppiness. Mm, not smelling much more. But this definitely screams IPA. If I had my eyes closed and put it in front of my nose, I would say, oh, an IPA. Let's give it a taste. Prost, my friends. Oh, you see the amount of head. Let me describe the head. It is uh, voluminous and it is uh, pretty foamy. White foamy head. Prost, my friends. So it's a, it's a medium body and it's lemony. I get a great lemon flavor from it. And it has that nice hoppy bite to it that you expect and that you grow to love if you like IPAs. It's not overly uh, bitter. 60 IBUs, I don't know where that falls on the scale with um, ordinary I IPAs or double IPAs, if you will, but um, it's not overly bitter. It gives you that nice bitterness, that dry hopped, as they say, and it is pretty balanced. Uh, you, you don't have a lot of malt, uh, which is characteristic of IPAs, but you have that citra hops taste on the back end. And so I give this a thumbs up. Drinkability, yes. Drinkability, thumbs up. This is a uh, decent, this is a pretty good IPA. If you enjoy the style, I think you enjoy this one coming out of Lancaster County, Pennsylvania. And it's very smooth, easy going, goes down smoothly, and it doesn't have a lot of uh, bite on the back of your throat or anything like that. It's very um, easy going beer. I highly recommend it. Until next time, folks.